Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Lions. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Lions. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy-ass temple of yours, Lions, as it take care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Come on in. Have a seat. I hope all has been well, Leos. All right. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Soul Tribe members. Gang, gang, I appreciate you all so much for your continuous love and support. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right. If you would love to become a Evolving Spirit and join the Soul Tribe Lions, definitely don't forget to click that join link down below. I do provide unlimited access to discounts for personal readings, email questions, and also love live stream questions when I go live, my love. You can definitely come check us out on Saturday night. We definitely have a good time. We pull cards. And if you have any love questions, all right, you can meet me there on Saturday night lives at 10 p.m. Central Time. All right, you can email me your questions, screenshot your payment, and you'll be able to place a spot in line, and I will provide you a number so that way you can remain anonymous as well, all my loves, all right? And I also place timestamps, Lions, right after the live stream as well. So if you would love to go back and reflect on your question, Leos, you do have the opportunity to do so in the future, all right? So let's dive in here. Welcome back. We're here another two days checking in with you spiritually, mentally, and emotionally, I say. So first, we're going to start with you, all right? It's very important that we check in with you here. As I mentioned here with your fellow fire signs, we have to do our spiritual check-in, right, Lions? Just like we go and we get a physical checkup, right, about six months up to a year, right? You get your physical check-in, make sure everything is working and correlating correctly, right? So we want to also check in with you spiritually all right it's very important as well that's the way we learn we love here and we evolve okay on all levels spiritually mentally and emotionally so let's do a check in with you first and then stick around I'm going to use the traditional tarot deck to dive into your love life all right lions to see what's coming towards you here in the month of october for love and then we'll finish out here with some love messages all right so we have freedom here yes i'm loving the colors here with this tour course here as well all right, we have I possess the power and the free will, Lions, to create my own happiness. Wow, yes, okay, this is giving me that fire energy vibe for sure. Okay, this is giving me that Sagittarius energy as well. Some of y'all may be engaging with the Sagittarius here, or you may have Sagittarius placements in your chart. Or you are definitely in Sagittarius energy where you're understanding the space and how the importance needs ills of having your own freedom and your own peace here, right? Wow, beautiful. So the affirmations here is a great affirmation here, okay, that you can utilize to say, I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness. Yes, you have the key to create your own universe, your own happiness, okay, your own bubble of joy, all right, Leo? So don't forget that. That's very important, okay? Freedom is definitely key to happiness, okay? We also have here peace coming out here for you. I am being of love and I release all negative energies. Wow, this is crazy. This is the same card actually that Sagittarius got for their reading here today as well. But however here, I am, okay, great, great affirmations here, right? I am a being of love, lions, and I release all negative energies, okay? So I feel like your higher self, we're checking in with you spiritually here, right? Your guardian angels here, your ancestors want you to know that now is a time for lions to go in every atmosphere, environment, place, situation, circumstance. Go in, in your consciousness, knowing that my peace and my freedom here is important, okay? This is also, for me, is giving me the energy of setting boundaries for yourself. These are boundaries, boundaries, vibes, okay? So needing to set boundaries from people, places, situations that you may feel like, you know, don't allow someone to over, you know, engage in your energy or, you know, take up more of your time than what you would want, okay? In a way of not doing it in a respectful, respectable matter okay i'm picking up here so by doing this and setting these type of boundaries for you not only do they come become more healthier for you okay mentally wise as well right 
but also here physically wise. So, you know, this gives you time to be with yourself, sit with yourself, enjoy yourself, and also have a balance for when you're ready to get out on the sea, lions, and show your beautifulness here, okay? Because we know that you all are the center of attention. You rule the sun energy, right? So look at the sun. Everybody sees the sun outside. So it's the same way with lions, okay? So you still need that time and that space and that quietness and that peace to be with lion, to be with yourself, all right? And so I feel like this is a time where people are going to have to start under, uh, you know, understanding that. And if they can't, you know, unfortunately, clients, you have to do what you have to do and you have to set those boundaries and put those boundaries in place here, okay? Wow, beautiful energy there and messages from your guardian angels, your higher self, and your ancestors here, okay? So that was your spiritual check-in. Thank you so much, Lions. You can pull up your pants. You can go ahead and I will come back in once you get done, put your clothes back on, and then we'll go over your chart here, all right? So beautiful. I love it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> yes, I'm so silly, Lions. You know how you have to go to the doctor and you do your checkup and you have to pull, you know, I have to take some clothes off and put that little gown on that shows your ass and you can feel all the fucking breeze. The, the you know when you got your goddamn gown and, and you feel a little hole out a little space you help feel a little breeze and air hit back there you know it's just an uncomfortable feeling okay all right so to say that my loves okay that's just using your imagination i'm having fun with you guys okay but i'm putting you in that same environment and atmosphere here and you're visualizing this right so we just had our spiritual checkup okay so good job so far it's checking out good here lions for your spiritual checkup so make sure that you're keeping freedom and peace in your space and your energy and you're setting those healthy boundaries for yourself for closing out this year in this cycle here okay wow beautiful thank you guardian angel so let's now dive into your love life all right lions let's see what's coming towards you in regards to love here guardian angels what do we have for my beautiful leos definitely if that resonated for you love so far don't forget to like subscribe my loves definitely be a part of family all right and definitely set that notification bell so that way you can be notified for when your readings come out and when i go live for wake and tarot lions all right definitely join me there i do go live monday through friday from 8 a.m central time okay we definitely have all zodiac sign readings for daily check-ins on different topics every day so you can definitely come in check in with your daily zodiac sign there and get your daily wake and tarot before you start your day all right so definitely subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can be aware of when i go live loves all right so let's dive into your love life here let's see what we have here in regards to love all right the first card we have is a nine of pentacles here all right yes i love it all right standing in your own power all right being beautiful very tapped in spiritually here okay definitely beautiful process here okay you guys are now balancing the physical realm here and the spiritual realm here very well okay your guardian angels is very proud of you okay you're at the nine of pinnacles all right that's at the ninth ether that's at the ninth being of where you're at spiritually here okay you've learned a lot through your own experiences here right and your own you know situations in regards to relationships okay family right so you definitely have come into your own and it's beautiful lions yes we have page of swords you have a lot of eyes on you here lions definitely got some attention here going on okay you definitely have someone's attention here lions okay this could be an air sign here this could be aquarius a gemini or a libra all right lions that you have their attention and they're definitely watching you here and others of you are here this could be an earth sign here okay this could be a taurus a capricorn or a virgo here for others of you all all right and we have the chariot card here okay definitely taking that leap of faith energy here removing yourself from people places and situations that no longer resonate with you understanding the duality of everything here in life with this black and white here and i just see you driving and just going and what makes you happy from this town some of y'all literally could be moving or traveling to another city or another state here okay but you're definitely taking that leap of faith and you're going after what makes a lion's happiness and that's your own freedom and that's your own peace and whatever that is for you okay being around people who you know are happy to see you 
in your own skin right so this is where i feel like you're at with life this is beautiful we have the two of swords here air energy here again aquarius gemini and libra all right some of y'all there's definitely a decision here that's needing to be made here or some of y'all are in this space as in should i leave now should i go is it something that i want should i stay you know a lot of thinking and contemplating here i feel as well here and definitely guarding i get guarding with the two of swords as well guarding definitely putting that guard up when it comes to your energy as well so good job good job there all right look at that queen of cups here scorpio energy here all right some of you on this particular person here could be a scorpio or water sign we have pisces cancer and energy as well here okay but this is definitely loving yourself here okay and i see others here are loving who you are as well here this could be a mother figure here that some of y'all may be in tune and tapped in with here as in regards to your mother here okay some of y'all could be speaking with the mother or a father here okay but there is definitely an energy here i feel like as well lions that have love for you all right and they're watching you as well here this could be a lover here a significant other here okay wow and i've been speaking of this card and this energy i feel like during your reading here as in again taking a leap of faith and then ironically the card comes out the full card which represents taking that leap of faith all right going towards again your freedom your true happiness and peace over here okay what makes you happy here right and i see that now it's like you now have all the understanding you have all the resources Everything you need to know about, you know, people, places, situations, love relationships here with the Queen of Cups and people and how they had your own experiences with these individuals here. And now you're being able to be and walk into your own peace and happiness. And again, that's going to be whatever that is for you, right? Wow, beautiful lions. Definitely if that resonated for you so far, my loves, again, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell, loves. I am available for personal readings. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information it was down below in the description box, my loves. Let's move forward here and get you some love messages here before we head out. Wow, beautiful spread here. I just love the energy. It's even a peaceful energy right now. So I feel like a lot of you all just finally have found peace in you and lions and what makes you happy you're now being around people who make you happy or you know it's a giving even exchange energy right there's no type of energies or intentions involved right it's just pure intentions are involved around the new places and areas that you are attending and being around some of y'all coming around your soul tribe right i love it beautiful so let's give you a love message here guardian angels what do you have for my beautiful lions and lioness what do we have for the beautiful lions and lioness in regards to love? What's the love messages here, Garden Angels? Thank you. We have let go of control issues, all right? Allow this situation to unfold naturally here, okay? So in regards to your higher self here, in regards to, of course, your love life here, when this becomes between you and for some of y'all, this could be in reference to your significant other, someone that you were in a relationship here with. This could be, again, the mother or the father of your child here with the queen of cups here, okay? But there's a situation here where you're just needing to allow everything to unfold naturally here, lions. Don't try to force a particular person or a situation to occur. Allow everything to unfold. Allow the, the universe and divine to show itself for you so you can get your own clarity and gain your own peace and freedom from this situation or relationship here. This is someone that you may not so much as in trust in regards to their past decisions and things that they may have done. So you're kind of skeptical about this person. You can see how his face expression is looking towards her. And then you can see how she is looking towards him. It's like something here you may feel like is off with the relationship or this person or what they are doing or their intentions here. Your guardian angels is like, look, Leos, don't worry about it. Okay, allow everything to unfold naturally and you'll be able to see the full intentions of everyone and everyone who played in this situation. So don't try to control this particular situation or whatever this issue is for you. It's going to be different for everyone, okay? But those are messages in regards to your love messages there. Wow, beautiful reading here today. That has completed your reading. Again, Duffy, thank you all, Lions, for your continuous love and support. Duffy, if you enjoyed the energies here again, 
Don't forget to click that join link down below and join the Soul Tribe, my loves. Again, set that notification bell to your adjustments for when I go live every rising Monday through Friday. Again, for Wake and Tarot. And that's for all Zodiac signs. Also, you can join me on Saturday nights if you would love to at 10 p.m. Central Time. If you have any love questions, all right, we definitely do still have spots available. You can email me your question and I will screen uh, I will screenshot and show you your number as well. So that way you'll have that number for when you are up next. And again, you'll be able to remain anonymous because there are crazy scammers out here, right, Lions? And I will have a timestamp right next to your number, right, following out of the live stream. So again, you can always go back and reflect on your question, Lions, all right? Thank you all so much for your continuous love and support, Leos. Shout out to the Evolving Spirit. Shout out to the Soul Tribe. Gang, gang. All right. I appreciate you all, Lions. As I always say, loves, all right, you stay healthy, okay, and enjoy your wealth and embrace the new color this week with us focusing in on the color yellow, all right? So, yes, Lions, I love you all so much. You take care, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.